Here's how to do the test. We shall be following ADA recommendations for pinprick testing. In point of fact, although you will only perform this test once a month, it's a perfectly good idea to do it when checking your feed as part of your daily routine. Have a look at the picture on the reverse of the pack. You simply copy the action in the diagram. It couldn't be much more straightforward. Always remember though, don't ever use this test on an open wound or badly damaged skin. Number one, first grasp the Medipin between your thumb and finger and snap the tab to expose the point. Two, next, and as in the picture, gently press the point onto your big toe between the knuckle and nail with just enough pressure to dimple it. Do not try to pierce the skin. You should be able to feel a sharp pinprick sensation. Three, use the same Medipin to test the other big toe exactly the same way. Inability to feel pinprick on either big toe is regarded as an abnormal test result and you should consult your doctor. Number four, finally disposal. Though not truly sharp, dispose of the Medipin safely. It can go either in a sharps container if you have one or you can make the point safe simply by compressing it. Just flatten the point against a robust surface such as the bathroom sink. Medipin has no metal parts and is designed to allow the point to flatten down without breaking off. Then you can throw everything, including the tab, away. To be extra confident, you may even snap the Medipin in two. Last of all, repeat the test monthly and check the box on the calendar to record the results.